sometimes trying to save money on the front end really, really costs you money on the back end. What we're looking at here is a ton and a half heat pump. As you can see, it's frozen up. But there's not really a lot I can do with it by checking Freon because of uh, uh, the ductwork issues it has on the inside. Unfortunately, we've got to repair that before we can check Freon. Alright, so here we are down at the basement air handler. And as you can see, that's an 8 inch vent or 8 inch return duct. We have another 8 inch return duct. And it's just not enough. So what we're going to do, we're going to remove that 8, install a 12, run it up the wall, across the ceiling, and then Y off right here. And where that 8 goes through the wall, we're going to put a, a 12, 10, 8 Y. I'm going to drop a 10 inch duct and do a 14 by 14 by 10. That way we, we should have enough return here then. All right, so we're down in the theater room. So as you see on the ceiling up there, there's a supply vent there and a supply vent there. And with the doors closed, this room becomes really, really tight. And it just overheats this room. Since there's no way to get a return vent or return duct over into the mechanical room, um, with just no way, there's a bathroom on the other side of the wall, finished ceiling, there's just no way to do it. So what we're gonna do is, is all we're going to do is just go right there, cut a 14 by 14 uh, pass through vent, and hopefully relieve some of the pressure in this room. Uh, that's about the only thing we can do. Um, they really, really complain. It's uncomfortable when they're watching uh, movies in this room. Mastic only makes it look like you know what you're doing. Alright, so I got the uh, return cut in from this side. Through here, got a little bit of airflow through there. So that's going to help out a lot in that room. There's Maggie. She's been helping me a little bit. Good girl, Maggie. So, up there's one return, and over there's another. You notice one is higher than the other. Then there's the return I cut in today. Right there. Comes up. It wires right there. And then it goes down. Attaches to there. Uh, so you see right there is the one return and the reason it had to go lower is because of the header and back over there above that two by four is the other return so that would explain why one is higher and one is lower doesn't really explain why it didn't have enough airflow but it's fixed now